Hi, I'm Gus, an application support specialist here at Blue Marble Geographics. And today I'm going to be talking about how we can customize the styling of our point cloud classifications in Global Mapper Pro. So we can see here that I have some point cloud data loaded and I've already done the work of assigning classification to points that make up our ground and our buildings and our trees. If we open our 3D viewer here, we can see that there are a lot of these little spots of unclassified points. And if we switch to color by RGB, we can see that these are vehicles within our study site. Now these don't really fit into any of our uh, built-in classification types. If we, we can quickly look at our list of built-in classification types, ground, low, medium, high vegetation, buildings, etc. But we have nowhere to um, classify these vehicles. So today we're going to create a custom classification that we can assign these vehicles to. So I'm going to open up this filter LiDAR data tool. I'm going to scroll down to one of these empty slots, this reserved for ASPRS definition. I'm going to right click and we are going to name our new classification movable objects. I'm going to right click again. I'm going to assign a color to our new classification. And I'm going to select apply. Now I'm going to quickly turn off our points classified as ground. We can see here that we can easily manually select these. And I'm going to assign these to our new custom classification by selecting this change LiDAR class tool. I'm going to scroll down this list to our new classification, our movable objects classification. I'm going to select that. And we have now assigned these points our new classification. If we switch to color by classification, we can see that they have now um, been assigned correctly um, into a useful uh, class. Now we can also customize the styling of our built-in classification types. And we can do this again in our filter LiDAR data. I'm gonna turn my ground back on quickly. Let's say we wanna change the color of our buildings. So I'm going to right click on this building classification. I'm going to set our class color. Let's make them yellow. I'm going to apply the change. You can see here that we've now edited the styling for that particular classification. If you're interested in learning more about how to customize the styling of your point cloud classifications in Global Mapper Pro, you can visit us at our website, bluemarblegeo.com, or send us an email to geohelp at bluemarblegeo.com. Thanks for watching.